been raised there for more years or whatever. Yeah. So a uh, video with Raheem Sterling went viral. Um, this is a while ago now. Yeah, yeah. Um, with him at his birthday party dancing with another female. And then I think who is his actual female, his girlfriend, proceeds to take the girl off of mm-hmm. Raheem Sterling. So my question was, mm-hmm. would you let your man whine on another girl? No. So, it, no, 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 no. If you want to whine, you can't find my behind. Here's the thing. For me, it's a respect thing. Once mm-hmm. I get in a relationship, no one else should have physical access to me. Mm-hmm. So when you're whining with someone, you're not whining with space. You're you're scrubbing up against someone else, isn't it? Right. So why would I allow... If, if we're not going to condone cheating, if we're not allowed to, to have other people touching our derrieres or me or, or me touching other man's, you know, uh, never regions, why now am I going to say it's all right because we're whining? It's still the same act that's being done. Mm-hmm. So no, I would no and things i went i went i went to um carnival with my man last year right listen we were we were we were, back, we were we were next to each other the whole time you know i gave him a little while we were coming through doing our thing if i ever if there ever was a female that tried no just know it's gonna be a real problem at that moment but right. likewise if a man tried to come to me i would so i'd be like what are you doing like no i don't it's not even a i don't think it's a possessive thing mm. but to a degree it almost is like and i'm not saying that oh you know i own him or he owns me and we can't live our lives right. but when you're physically, let's not lie, dancers like whining, mm. they are stimulating things of a sexual nature. I get you. I you get know? You. So why is it okay for me to do that with someone else just because we're dancing? No. I feel like trust is a big part though. If I trust that my man, do, okay, do you think, would you allow your man when he goes out without you to whine on other girls? Why would he want to do that? What if he doesn't want to do that, but a girl just push it back on him? Then I expect him to push her away. <laughs> do you think like if say he's a dancer and he just likes dancing mm-hmm. and like do you think that would take away a part of him where he always has to have you in mind like okay my woman wouldn't like this so i can't do this but as a dancer aren't there other dancers he can do that doesn't have to constitute in whining true true so you wouldn't just let your man whine on a girl i don't understand is he gonna let me whine on a man this is the thing like personally my view is coming from the caribbean culture and this is the same like you very much embody and represent my friend right now <laughs> and it's like i was saying to her like a dance is a dance like we take a wine and carnival and we move off like you get one and move like kind mm-hmm. of thing but at the end of the day i wouldn't feel like i'm happy when my man if i had a man because mm-hmm. he's non-existent he show up sometimes. <laughs> um if he goes out with his boys and other girls he's dancing on girls or whatnot yeah i'm not expecting him to be fake like as soon as he sees me now and we're together he's permanently on me i feel like there's a standard yeah, you can't be like, girl can't be like, you know what I mean? Everything out to expose and like you're winding up on her and you're there for time. If you dance with a girl for like less than a minute and you just move off, I don't see the problem in it. Like, and I trust my man. Like if I decide to get with a man, it's because I trust him. So I know in my head, yeah, he might be dancing and it might be seen as sexual, but I trust him to not... I, and it's fine female, and, like, you know what I mean? it's, it, and it's fine with trust but here's the thing don't forget these wines do arouse men mm. okay so I'm just flipping it back the same way I, I, I'm not going to be out there dancing with no man mm. I was expecting the same thing back from my man and my man's like my man is not about that he is not like he, he's not about to go dance with no one and he knows I ain't going to dance with no one it's not even because I have told him not to or he's told me not to right. it's just something I'm no longer interested in I have committed myself to one man so only one man gets access to everything that is me from the touching of my behind mm. to any you know little white only, only one man gets that access to me now so mm. for me that it's not even about trust like and I, I would expect I would be the same way when he's there and the same way when he's not there mm. do you understand so I for me it's a big no i get you but do you think that for your girlfriends then you are seen not seen but you come across as maybe not wanting to go out to certain things so maybe you oh i go be, out yeah you go i go out all the time so but would you stand still and have party? you not seen me dancing raves i'm the first one to dance <laughs> but i don't need no one to come dance with me like Rave, literally i'm the first one on that dance floor mm-hmm. i'll be doing my little thing i'm doing whatever but i don't need no one to come come do it next to me. if you come name me i'll just kind of do a walk away yeah, yeah and yeah. I, i'm sort of laughing at the party i don't feel like um, you stop living your life because you're in a relationship, Mm-mm. you know. And to be honest, I stopped whining with guys from before I got into a relationship. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Eventually, it became a thing where you know what? You're giving one wine to every man. That's ten man and one dance. It's enough, yeah, man. Not everyone needs to be feeling that. Yeah, this is what my friend said. She's like, uh, you're right. You're allowing these men to rub their willies on you, so you're seen <laughs> as loose. So I was just like, mm, okay, but at the same time, like if you put yourself in a very Caribbean environment where we um, perceive wine to be not serious. 
you can't be offended or get upset yeah. by 10 man coming to wine. It's just like if you go to carnival, sorry, and 10 man are like whining on you, like you can't get upset. If you know your man's gonna get upset because he might glimpse and see a man just whine on you and you didn't say no fast enough and then you guys are gonna argue about it later, I would say don't go to things like carnival. But girls, thanks for having me. You're <laughs> welcome. <laughs> like, you gotta wrap this. But yeah, you'll see this. Search Pulse 88.